Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Yaya. Today will be part two of the Oz Love Holiday Series where I'll be showing you simple, amazing DIY gift ideas for the holidays. For part two, I'm doing moisturizing lotion bars that will consist of cocoa butter, more more butter, and mango butter. All from Oz Love Organics, okay? And I'm going to combine all these butters with a cosmetic wax. You don't have to use beeswax, but you need some type of wax. This is what will hold your lotion bars together or else they will melt and lose their shape after molding. So you want to add some type of wax and I also will leave the ingredients in all the measurements down in the description box below for you guys for more reference, okay? Okay, once again, I'm combining my butters, waxes, and oils. This will be the base for my lotion bars. And then I'm going to melt them down over low heat so they won't lose their nutrients. Right, to safely melt our butters, we're going to create a double broiler. Just place your ingredients in a heat resistant container and place it in a pot or a pan with a couple inches of water. And then place that pot or pan onto the stove. Leave it on the stove for 30 minutes and then it's going to melt your butters perfectly. All right, that's it you guys. Once you have melted your butters, that is your base. You can pretty much do whatever you like from here. It's up to you to be as creative as you like. I'm using mica to give mine a little lavender tint just because I'm using lavender essential oil and vanilla essential oil. I thought it would be really cute. And I'm also gonna add a little sprinkle of herbs to my mixture and this is gonna make it look so beautiful. Um, but you can add whatever you like you guys. It's really up to you to be as creative as you like. Even if you wanna leave them plain you can also do that as long as you have your base which is the wax butter and the oils then you can create whatever type of lotion bar you like I just love the shimmer that Micah gives to these products it's so pretty Alright guys, for this next bar, I'm going to be adding a little bit of coffee and this is just to help exfoliate and polish the skin. Um, like I said, you can be as creative as you like so you can add something else besides ground coffee if you like to. No, the coffee will not absorb into your skin so you will have to wipe it off after using this bar. Alright, so a quick tip for you is while you're working on one of your bars, like mixing in whatever ingredients you like to mix in to make it special, make sure that the other portion of the base that you're not using is on the stove. Make sure it's on the heat because if it solidifies, then you'll have to start over as far as melting it. All right, so we're all set. Once you have your mixture inside the mold, leave it alone. Don't touch it, don't mess with it, or you're gonna leave a print or indent it some kind of way. Let it sit there for about 30 minutes to kind of solidify a little bit. Then you can put it in the refrigerator for mm, three hours to a day. I know I left mine in there for a day. I would really want to make sure that they were together, and they are, they're perfect. They're good and solid, and um, but they're going to stay like this. But of course, these beautiful butters like cocoa butter and more and more butter and mango butter, as soon as you touch them, they're, you know, um, melting into your skin. They're so beautiful. And I, I love these butters, you guys. And I love this lotion bar. Oh, this one came out really cute. I think this is my favorite one. I really like just how beautiful that one is. Oh, this one's gorgeous, too. Wow, these really came out great, you guys. I wasn't expecting that, especially with the coffee beans floating up to the top at first. But this actually came out really, really great, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you give this a try. And I want to thank Oz Love Organics once again for these amazing butters. You guys, go check them out. Go get you some high-quality ingredients for all your amazing creations, especially if you're trying to give out gifts for the holidays. 
these are perfect okay and make sure you're subscribed because there will be more videos all the way up into december you guys i'll be showing you some amazing simple diys okay all right don't forget to follow me on instagram and all that good stuff and i will see you in the next video bye